It is my last night in Boston before going home. Uh, we moved all of my stuff in to the U-Haul and I just thought I'd take y'all along with me. I'm in Trident Booksellers. This is my favorite bookstore in Boston and I'm looking for a book. It's by Eli Rallo. It doesn't look like they're gonna have it, but if not, it's fine. I'm just gonna look around. <laughs> Hey guys, um, I am back in my hotel room. There was a bit of a delay in the Uber, which is why I didn't film. And then I just got to my room and showered, but I'm back and I am enjoying a bit of dessert. Um, and I'm about to watch some YouTube videos and just wind down. And yeah, it's so weird. Um, I am moving back home to North Carolina to live where my parents live. Um, it's kind of a long story, but basically, um, yeah, it feels so strange because I've lived in Boston for two years, um, and a little over two years. It was officially two years in September, and I'm headed home, and I feel like it's a chapter closing, but another one opening, and I'm feeling, like, a little emotional, but I'm also, like, excited. It's, like, a weird mixture of feelings but yeah it's weird i'm sitting in my hotel room and tomorrow i'll be back in north carolina after two flights and yeah i'm excited because i'll be able to see my family more but i'm just i thought i would be more sad i am sad because i went to some like my favorite bookstore trident booksellers and then i went to one of my favorite restaurants dirty water dough pizza and I was like, I've been to these places so many times, but it won't be the last time like ever. I feel like my mindset is like, this isn't the end. It's, it's not goodbye forever. It's just goodbye for now. So that's sort of the mindset I'm having. As I leave, um, I still love Boston. I just think it's um, a good decision for me to go back home now, or at least for now. So yeah, I'm about to... Actually, let me show you my little setup. I got some YouTube videos going here, watching Vlogmas. I'm also eating this incredible vegan cookie from Levain Bakery. It is huge. Their cookies are gigantic, but they're, um, they're delicious. So yeah, I'm just gonna wind down. I'm probably just gonna watch a few more videos. And I have a flight that um, takes off at eight. Um, early flight, um, so I'm gonna set my alarms, wind down, put my retainer in, and go to sleep. So yeah, this has been fun, sort of taking you all along with me on my last night in Boston. All right, bye guys.